Hey guys, welcome to another video and today I'm looking at netting. How often it spawns, where it spawns, the chances of boats spawning it. And I thought to do that I could look at one location in particular and that's Berezeki, which I'd say completely wrong. But this is in the top right hand corner of the map in the northeast above Svetlo and it has a number of boats and spawning points. And what I've done is I've gone in to 15 unlooted servers at this location to have a look at what spawns at these boats. Firstly what we're going to do is have a look around the town and the layout. And there's some interesting things that I've noted as I did this. Berezeki is a small town. It has six buildings. It actually is a spawning point for vehicles, but it's obviously got lots of fishing boats because it's a little fishing community. One fishing boat in particular spawns most of the loot. It's this one here that we see in front of me here. There are some nets there, and this really is the main spawning point. So out of, what, the seven, eight boats that are here, it's that one that spawns most of the loot. And it doesn't look any different, really, other than it's upright... This one here is upright, but that doesn't spawn any loot at all, really. These are the boats down here on the coast, right on the beachfront here. Rarely spawn any loot. I found, out of the 15 servers, I think I found two pairs of wellies and a hat down here on this location. So for some reason, that individual boat up by the houses, further inland there, has been assigned more importance when it comes to spawning. Now, I don't know why they've done that, but what it makes me realize is that even though a lot of these boats may spawn um, crappy little items, only a few prioritize netting. And that's key. We need the netting to make gillies. If you want to make a ghillie, you need to know which boats spawn netting. And so that's going to be quite a bit of research. You can run down the coast and even if you find one that spawns, say, boots or wellies or hats, you're not going to necessarily find any netting there. So the randomization that they talk about is pretty false when it comes to boats. So that was really probably the most eye-opening thing I found with this, this location. That the one place, the one boat, is, is prioritized for net spawning. Out of the 15 servers, I found a number of rods in that same boat as well. So the rods seem to be spawning where the nets spawn. So that was six rods out of the 15 servers. I also found um, just a few other items, like a paddle. The paddles were rare. It was spawning on that, that special prioritized boat. And um, the wellies and the hat I found nearer the coast. It's also worth noting that these special boats do not change from server to server. They're the same across the board. As far as net stats go, I found them at 6 of the 15 servers. 16 nets in total. In varying bundles. Some were in 3, others 2. And one actually was just a single net. In conclusion, if you can locate these special boats, make a note of where they are, you have a one in two chance of finding nets when you get to them based upon my research here. And you're probably going to find a bundle of two or three nets. You could even find a rod, a paddle, or something like that along with them. Just a quick note, the servers that I checked were all largely empty, unlooted. Now there's a small chance obviously someone may have been in there and looted up that server. But most of them were fresh, and it also takes into consideration that there's a good chance when you're on a server, someone may have looted that area already. Guys, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, click the thumbs up, and if you haven't subbed already, it'd be awesome if you could. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.